Hello, today I'll be coding, I'm not exactly sure what, um, we're going to see what happens. So we're going to start with a number of bars, let's say something like 20, uh, a number of loops, let's say something like 3, and we're going to have a total number, and this is the number of bars times the number of loops. So yeah, this is the total number, we're going to have an assembly, and here let's say we have a loop, um, okay, and let's create bars and let's pass on the index so um, index and this is going to be this okay uh, now let's see um, my assembly is going to be no actually let's make all divs I'm a bit out of the loop myself, so not really sure how this is going to work out, but uh, we'll see. Okay, 50%, left 50% as well. Okay, uh, this should... Uh, 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 uh. Okay, uh, let's do a width, let's say something like this, uh, a height, let's say, 2 pixels. Now, for my bar, um, let's give them width, height, let's give them a background. Okay, now I'm seeing them. And let's the margin here, and it's minus half the height, and then um, minus half the width. Um, and now, what is wrong here? Okay, um, I don't really get it. Okay, let's do a transform, uh, rotate. Let's do something like this. Um, Times 360 degree, degrees, blah, 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 blah. or make it one turn. Why not? Um, over the total number. So, um, star uh, and sorry. Okay. So uh, now this should do it, okay, and it does. Let's also add a translation. I don't know, something like this. Okay, now let's introduce the loops thing and that kind of stuff. Um, so the number of bars. And let's also have a star element for i from 1 all the way up to the number of bars and then increment it and here we set a bar and child but I can't type number um, of bars uh, n plus um, i plus 1 and here I set a j that's i okay so um, this should pretty much do it for now and now let's do uh, rotate um, j times half a turn over the number of bars per loop something like this uh, let's make this zero by default so we don't have issues there okay and let's make this some um, 0.5 to get a more interesting result okay uh, let's increase this number because it looks a bit silly like this 
it's not very interesting. Now, um, let's make this, let's take this, this calc from there and make this um, an HSL. Uh, use this, and this is going to be 360, um, use I and N. Actually, something like this. Okay, much better. HTML. Something like this. Okay, this looks nice. Um, now that we've done this, we can increase the number of loops to something like this because why not? Um, okay, um, and we can make this uh, translation, we can also make it a calc. So, um, three, let's say, times, and I need to interpolate this, something like this. This looks pretty cool. Um, and let's also say um, I'll be adding, and this is going to be zero initially. Um, and here let's um, subtract it. Or I can do something 0.5 degrees. Um, okay, something like this. And um, now I can animate this stuff. So CSS register property um, name. So um, first off, I'm going to have that factor. Syntax, it's just a number. And initial, uh, let's say it's 0.75. I don't know, I, I don't really care. Um, okay. And let's just uh, copy paste this again and make this zero as initial value. Okay, and let's maximize this because we won't be needing anything else. Something like this. So um, keyframes. So um, F, and this is going to be something like 3, and animation, let's say it's going to be linear infinite, and easy now. Infinite alternate. Let's see. Oh, come on. All right, so, um, yeah, this is it. I, I think this is a pretty cool result. So, um, I'll just be leaving it at this. Now, if I were to make this some. Um, like this. Well, I could make it go down even lower to something like 0.25. Let's see how that would look. Oh, 
暖心。嗯， actually I might do it a point twenty five and make this like this. Let's see. Um, and actually, there's something else I can do to make this more interesting.、Uh, just add in a mix blend mode screen. This should make it a lot more interesting. And it just down goes in there. Let's see. Okay, I didn't. Mix blend mode. Let's see how that looks. Actually, I can do minus. Why not? Actually, I can have a second factor. So、um, let's try something like this.、Um, so it's going to go to minus one. Um, this it's going to be here. Um, and this. Is going to go to one, okay. Sorry about all that noise, it really sounds like a train. I swear it isn't. Um, so, um, yeah, this is going to be pretty much the same. So let's see. Okay, this is even more interesting. So yeah, I think I'm going to leave it at this. Not going to、uh, change things even more. Um. Actually, I could、uh, change this to I don't know 1.9. Oh yeah, this is actually even more interesting because it gives、uh, a lot more interesting results. So yeah, I'll be leaving it at this. I hope you've enjoyed this video, and if you have. And you want me to be able to do more stuff like this in the future and not end up dying in a trash can? Please consider supporting my work. You can do it in one of the ways explained in the description below. With a donation, there's going to be a link. Or you can make this kitty very happy by getting her something off her Amazon wish list. Or you can at least share this to show the world what can be done with CSS these days. Because honestly, I think it's pretty damn cool. In any event, thanks for watching.